YouTube, this is Gear Geeking on a guitar under $800. I've been finding uh, a lot of guitars by these. I'm going to do an unboxing first. So I've been wanting to see what this thing looks like. This is a hammer. Hammer guitars from the 70s. Only, uh, when I look, I only have a few different models. Oh, I think it was five different models. And, um,. This one, and they're relatively very inexpensive, all under a thousand dollars. Some was down to three hundred dollars ish. This one was around the price range which I was going for. Um, I think this was seven hundred and fifty bucks, right around seven hundred fifty dollars. So, what I'm trying to do is show that you can buy a guitar these days for right around uh, eight hundred dollars. It's such a high quality pro level guitar uh, that it makes it really difficult to spend thousands of dollars sometimes on guitars. Um, so sometimes unneedingly. So let's start off with this one. I'm gonna see how bad a tune it is. Not very bad at all. It's like a half step down. So this is an arch top. Uh, it's a 2017 uh, model arts top with the veneer um, all mahogany with the veneer on top of it obviously um, graphite nut proprietary pickups um, they're hammer proprietary pickups which say, uh, claim that they have a wide range of tonality. Um, so they're not probably heavily distorted or high gain-ish. Probably really middle ground, but we'll see. This thing was almost completely just one half step under. So that's awesome. Take a look at it. The veneer on this thing is beautiful. Uh, it's got a binding. Ooh, the neck. Doesn't uh, I don't feel the frets nice and you don't feel the see all the back oh the wood you can see it I don't know if you can see it you can see it but it looks all black but you can actually see a little bit of grains and wood that carry over to the rosewood neck uh, um, in the back of the rosewood neck in, made in Indonesia the hammer itself. Has like a mother of pearl. The dots are just dots, standard dots. Um, it's just like a piece of plastic I got to take off. Hopefully this doesn't. All right, we'll see what happens here. Right, it's tuned. It was very well. It looks great right off the bat. Nice looking guitar. The little uh, emblem hammer shines. So here we go. short really quick um, never played this guitar in my life just it's awesome it was cool I mean I'll be playing this one for a couple hours after I turn this thing off but look at that that was awesome sounding it sounded really good I just uh, did this whole little setup on my Jet City amp on a uh, Bulgara cabinet straight through so that those pedals are not doing anything I set it up with my Gibson Flying V stock guitar which uh, was, didn't sound as powerful as this. Uh, this really projected very well. Uh, it has these little pieces of plastic i got to take out, so 
off the uh, like a cover just to make it so it doesn't get scratched. Um, once I take that off, I'm sure this will even be uh, even louder. Um, awesome! Look at that. Under eight. I mean, there was no place that I would not take that guitar and play it. No place whatsoever. Be welcome in any stadium, any club whatsoever. All right, Gear Geeks, that's a hammer guitar.